Like all the videos on Psych and Catch channel are made possible by fans like you. Totally. Ah, hello there. It's been quite some time since I've had any visitors. And what have we here? Oh, such an exquisite beauty. I saw many a beautiful princess back at the castle. But you, my dear, oh, you outshine them all. It's easy to see why your fellow travelers guard you so closely. What? You saying you can see the old princess all proper like? Of course he can. Even as a horse, her inner beauty shines through. That's right, my darling. Wait a moment. How can you recognize this horse as my beautiful princess? A horse, you say? <laughs> How curious. Please excuse me, princess. Indeed, here is her mane and her tail. She is a horse. <laughs> Curiouser and curiouser. <laughs> As you can see, my sight failed me long ago. Now, I view the world through my mind's eye instead. And what it sees is a princess, not a beast of burden. Curious travelers, might you tell me what has happened here? I see. So, a curse has been placed upon her. Now, I may just have a way to return her to her former self. Uh, Yes. Why don't we give it a try? Really? Where? How? Go oh, blimey! Don't sneak up on me like that! <laughs> it was in the cart the entire time, Yangus. <laughs> what are you flapping about? I've been here the whole time, you... <laughs> okay, that's been said twice now. I can't say for sure if it will work, but... Have her drink from the spring. Its enchanted waters have been known to lift curses. Why don't you try it and see? Return to normal. What's wrong, Father? Why aren't you saying anything? Am I just dreaming? Or is this some new trickery? No. No, my dear. I'm sorry. It's just that you take my breath away. Come here and let me look at you. Oh, Father. Medea, my darling Medea. I'm so sorry for making you pull the carriage. It must have been so hard for you. I promise, I'll make it up to you. Oh, no, Father. You mustn't worry. This isn't just about me. I'm just happy that I could be of service to everyone. That's my Medea. Well, it's high time I restored my own visage to its former glory. Father? Hmm? What's Medea? Oh, my.
my princess. <laughs> what is this new devilry? It seems our celebrations were premature. Hmm. The curse placed upon the princess must be strong indeed. If the waters don't work, there is but one path left open to you. You must find and defeat the one who placed the curse upon her, Dulmagus. It is the only way to restore the princess to her true form. You must persevere, no matter how long and hard the road ahead. And now I pray you will excuse me. My old bones get chilled so easily. So, something that I always forget to do when playing this is coming back here on a regular basis to talk to Medea. And it's just something that I'm terrible about. But since I'm streaming this LP, and you guys are super good at nagging me about I'm things like party chat. To be so selfishly, <laughs> but I have a favor to ask. I'm only human for the briefest of moments after drinking from the spring. But it would make me very happy if you could bring me back here every now and then. I'd like to be able to talk to you again. Just like we used to. Back at the castle. We can forget all about the curse. Even if it's only for the few minutes we share together. I can feel the enchantment wearing off. Consider it as a request from me as well. She asks for so little of us, it really is the least we can do. Actually, no. Think of it as an order. Understood? Do I think Medea had a thing for the hero? Absolutely. I ship it. Very well. Now that that's decided, we can move on. All right, so now that that's been done, there's actually, there's supposed to be a treasure chest, like, right around here. I know we got the blue one. Let's check over here real quick. Yeah, go away. You never finish the game. I'll do my best to not spoil things. I will do my best. It's definitely worth finishing, though, Nako Girl. There are many, many good reasons why this is my favorite Dragon Quest. Nah, the hero's not gonna have a harem. A harem of who? Who's after the hero? Don't say Jessica. Don't say Jessica, because she and Angela were meant to be together. <laughs> Could you not? Stupid Trevil. Frog faces. There's a special drakey. There's supposed to be a treasure chest over here. Where is it? Ah, g fine. Ow! He's got a thing for Jess. Jess is having none of it. <laughs> no. Let's 
over here. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Is it in the spring? Is that why I'm not seeing it? Ah, gah. I think it's further south. It is further south. Okay. In fact, I don't think I can get over there yet. I think I might need to be able to fly. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. All right, so there's one chest. I think I can get to the other one this way. No. Probably can't drop off here. No, can't. But, but, I can reach this chest. <laughs> Fifteen hundred gold coins, my word. Then there's another one down there somewhere. I think we have to come in from that way, though. Ah, ha, 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 Thank you, Yangus. Hey, Angelo, how about you just open with that next time, huh, buddy? Too. Ah, damn it! Monsters everywhere. Alright, now I'm in a hurry to get to Argonia. That'd be a good place to take a break. No. No. Monsters everywhere. Everywhere. We'll do more exploring later. But I really do want to get to our garden, you know. Oh no! Oh no! You know what I didn't check? Oh, okay, there weren't any for the spring. Alright. <laughs> Seems like an obvious one. Ooh, 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 I think the hood is also a good monster. Because we should have our first monster team around this point. It's totally doable around this point. 
Ouch. Oh my god, stop! <laughs> I was getting a little concerned there. <laughs> a gold monster coin! Heck yeah, I want you to uh, join my party. Who are we going to get rid of, though? Foul Foul? Probably Faunus. I, I can't imagine Faunus is going to be better than him. I don't have, like, a list of their stats or anything in front of me, but... Did you see him tensioning up like that? That's something I don't think the Faunus can do. Princess and I can enter the kingdom, looking as we do. We have Dual Magus's treachery to thank for that. All the more reason to find him and put an end to his schemes as quickly as possible. I'm not about to let Dual Magus's hellish curse cheat my daughter of a match made in heaven. Hmm. 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 Match made in heaven. You heard it here first, folks. Match made in heaven. Oh my gosh, it's an inn. It's an inn. Oh my gosh. We'll, we will explore and buy things after the break, but right now we're going to head to the church, we're going to save. I am going to take a uh, quick biological needs break, and then I will return after that. Hope everybody's enjoying this Let's Play. I don't know why you wouldn't be. I mean, we're like 50-odd episodes in now. Almost to what I consider to be the halfway point. I don't know how accurate that, that is, though. I consider the uh, the battle with Dual Magus to be the halfway point. Might be incorrect. That might be more of like the 30% point. But we are approaching it. We are definitely approaching it. Good lord, I want Angelo to gain eight more levels before we get there, and I don't think that's going to happen. Might actually have to go and do some liquid metal slime grinding. All right, everybody. Taking a break. Thank you so much for watching. I'm your host, Saigon, and I'll be right back. <laughs>